Good morning and welcome in. Trucker Rudy here. We are on the way to uh, Edmonton, Alberta right now. We just left uh, Merritt, uh, BC here. And it uh, looks like it's going to be a beautiful day. And it is. I am happy today. Uh, I should be able to make it to Edmonton today. Edmonton today. It's only 885 kilometers today. So that should be no problem. It's uh, a little bit, uh, I guess, 550, 570 miles, somewhere around there. And uh, so, yeah, I should be able to make it there today. And uh, hopefully, I get me a reload out of there right away, real quick. Today is Thursday, uh, the August 25th. I mean, uh, August 28th. I, so I got my dates all screwed up there. But uh, anyways, uh, hopefully, get me a load home there from there. And then. Uh, go home and uh, we'll see what the weekend brings. Uh, I hope it's going to be a beautiful weekend because this is the, probably one of the last weekends, uh, long weekends that there is going to be this summer. So uh, I would really like to go camping one more time before uh, before summer officially ends for us, you know. But anyways, uh, we'll get uh, get the day going here and see what happens. We'll see you guys uh, can uh, and watch what uh, what I see today. Alrighty, I am in Cam Loops, BC right now. That's where we got the DOT scale. And over here we got to do a, uh, a brake check here. So uh, we'll kick the tires and we'll get down the road. Alrighty, just finished doing the brake check up here and uh, we'll go over the scale and see what they want. Looks like they just pulled that other truck around to the back. So we'll see. Uh, We'll see what they got going on today. Maybe they do inspections today, we'll see. I don't think our company's got a pretty good reputation, so I don't think they will be inspecting us today, but you never know, right? Could be my lucky day. But yeah, we'll have to see and uh, wait. What's happening? Yeah, so far looking pretty good with the weight, so I don't know how heavy I am, but uh, looks like 10,000 kg. Yeah, that's not bad. We can be 15, 15, 4, I believe. Just rolling over with the back axles right now, and we'll wait for a light. Hopefully, that will continue saying next axle. So, well, looks like it's good. Yeah. Alrighty. We are good to go. We'll put the hammer down and get as quick to Edmonton as we can. So we'll see you down the road. Yeah, it just started raining over here, but way down there, that's where the city of Kamloops is. That's where all the people live. I don't know why it is, but they always live at the bottom, right? Yeah. And then if they get flooded, well, then they complain, right? But anyways, that's just my thinking. All right, we are going to go over here on the Highway 5, going towards uh, Jasper, but that will take us towards the Highway 16, which takes us to uh, to Edmonton, but I just figured I'd show you this a little bit. Always uh, beautiful views up here, you know, so. Continue on this road for 799 kilometers. All right, we got the monster bear up here on the right. Say hello to him. All right. We just passed through uh, Blue River Town here and uh, still on Highway 5, so making our way down to Edmonton. Alright, now let's just have a look at this. You got this humongous mountain in front of us there. It's so tall that the clouds are even touching it. They're lower than what the mountain is. Now tell me if that's not beautiful. You got snow on top up there. Oh, that looks just so cool. Look at the sunshine on the mountains there. That's just amazing. Amazing what nature can bring you, eh? I mean, what amazes me the most is how these trees can grow all the way to the top of the mountain up there. You know, like that just... And then they grow up on a straight line, straight up, you know? Uh, like that's just something amazing that uh, that I find at least 
But anyways, I just had to show that. Crossing order, entering Alberta. All right. Changing time zone. As you can see, we are entering Alberta right now. That's a good sign. We got about another four hours to go to Edmonton. So that should be doable. I sure hope so. Alrighty. What is this up here on the right in the ditch? I'll have a look at that. That looks like a trailer axle or something like some kind of axle. Well, it looks like up there, up ahead, that's where he is parked. Yeah, definitely. He looks like he has lost his trailer axle. Have a look at that. That's amazing, eh? On the right, to highway two. Alrighty, just finished uh, switching trailers up here in Edmonton. We got ourselves a reload. Yeah, we're happy, 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 happy. We are on our way back home now. Should be able to make it back to uh, Steinbeck by Saturday morning. So uh, we are going to go camping this weekend. I guarantee you that. And I'm going to be with the guy that always makes nice barbecue. So you know what to expect, eh? And we might do some tubing again. So, uh, But this time I have the GoPro and we'll be able to do a better filming of that. So we'll be we'll be in good shape. But anyways, I'm real excited as you can tell to go back home and see Mama. It's been almost two weeks, and uh, you normally don't stay out that long. But hey, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do, eh? To get the extra mile, and we'll go home, and uh, I'll be home uh, for a couple of days. Uh, gotta do the safety on the truck, and. Then, uh, I'm also going to uh, replace the uh, brakes on the steering uh, axle on both sides of the truck. Get that done and get the truck inspected there at the, my shop that I usually take it to to make sure that we'll pass safety once I go get it done and then we'll get the safety done and hopefully everything will be good. So anyways, I'm going to make my way down over to the Flying J on the other side of Edmonton and go fuel up, take a much needed shower and probably something to eat and we'll be going to sleep after that and get up early and go again tomorrow go home alrighty just finished my day up here got down to the flying J safely and uh, fueled up now it's time to go eat and have a shower and uh, go to bed I guess but anyways I'm gonna cut this for today and uh, thanks for watching we'll see you tomorrow at 5 a.m. Mm -hmm.